Hey guys, I'm Tom the Tech Chap and I've got the brand new Dell XPS 13. Now this isn't the best studio or place to film this really, but it's the only chance I've had to get hands on with the new XPS. So this is the 9380, the 2019 edition, and it's in this beautiful frost white color. It's also gonna come in the usual black and silver and also a rose gold. Now I wouldn't say this is a major overhaul or a revolution of the XPS. This is the third iteration of this current sort of style and design. So it's been around the block a couple of times, but with this new model, Dell say they've perfected the formula. So let me run you through what's new. And the first thing you'll notice, the very first thing, because when you have it closed like this, is that you can now just about open it just about <laughs> one-handed. You couldn't do that with the other one. That's due to a slightly improved hinge mechanism. So you can, as I say, just about open it one-handed and it makes it feel a little bit more premium. So while that's fairly trivial, the good news is that they fixed my biggest criticism with the XPS lineup, the webcam. Previously, on the first gen one, we had it down here. Then they upgraded it to the middle. Either way, still looking up your nose. Finally, apparently after two years of development, they've invented a whole new camera system, which means they can fit the webcam in the top bezel. Now they do admit that the bezel is slightly, slightly thicker than last year to accommodate it, but not much. And it still fits within their spec of infinity edge design. That's much better. So it's now, reasonable quality, the lighting in here is a bit rubbish, but quality's good, the position is nice. I can now actually have a Skype call or a web conference without everyone seeing out my nose. So the new webcam is definitely welcome, although it doesn't actually support Windows Hello for face unlocking, but we do get a fingerprint reader built into the power button, so it's not really a big deal. In addition to the improved hinge and the refined webcam, we also now have a proper high dynamic range screen. The previous XPS did have a HDR screen, but that was all achieved through software. It was kind of pretend HDR. This is the first native HDR panel on an XPS. It also supports the Dolby Vision form of HDR. So if you're watching Netflix movies or shows that support Dolby Vision, then you'll get the best experience on here. There's a caveat though, because yes, while it is now native HDR, the screen brightness still only peaks at 400 nits. So it's not gonna be quite the same experience as watching it on a HDR TV that maybe can pump out 800 or 1000 nits, but it's definitely a step up. Specs wise, we've got the new 8th gen Whiskey Lake processors, i3, i5, or i7. That's gonna give you around a three to 5% boost on last year's XPS, so nothing really to write home about. In terms of weight and thickness and design, it's all very, very similar from before. So the XPS 13 continues to be one of the best laptops you can buy. It's not a night and day difference from before, but there's a few little tweaks. Webcam, the hinge, HDR display, Whiskey Lake processors, and also we get new cinema sound and cinema display, fancy software trickery from Dell. So overall, it's a bit of an upgrade, but if you already own an XPS from the last year or so, probably not worth upgrading. So the XPS 13 will start from $900. It's available from this January, and it really is one of the best laptops you can buy. A great travel companion, a great ultrabook. It would be nice if they had an option to give you like an MX150 GPU in it for a little bit more power, but aside from that, I can't really criticize it. Yes, it's the same design for the third year in a row, but still a beautiful laptop and I would highly recommend it. But what do you reckon? Are you tempted by the new XPS 13? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching guys. Hit that like and subscribe button down there somewhere if you wanna see more of my videos and I'll catch you next time right here on the Tech Chat. Now I'm gonna try and steal this without anyone seeing. See ya.